Hey guys, this is Kletos, part two, journey to get better with his neuropathy. We have lots of emotional issues that we had to work through. We taught him lots of things like balance board here. We did a lot of digital palpation, found out he has a lot of problems with his chest and his AC joint. We adjusted his thoracics here. We adjusted his L5, tons of arthritis down here. AC joint separation, which I'm pointing right here when he was back in high school. We're showing how his neck is associated with his AC joint and how it's affected. We adjusted his AC joint, and I'm gonna let you watch the rest of the story. Oh. Woo! Look at you. You're not gonna punch me, are you? He almost did. <laughs> no. I had a big, uh, big moment on Saturday when I took my dad to kind of like an emergency. Yeah, I got, and got stressed. Got really and I stressed. got stressed out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, missed an appointment and okay, whatever. So I don't care about that as much as I care about what did, you, what did, you, how did you mess up this weekend? Well, I think that through not me. just the pain. No, but before that, you didn't even do the notes I told you to do. This guy's in serious denial. So I told him to do all this stuff, take pictures, do notes, work on his posture, tell him how to sit properly. How did that all go? All I did was the walking. All I could say is I did good was the Why walking Why did you do the notes? Weekend. Huh? Why did you do the notes? Why didn't I do And that, that was before your dad's emergency? That was just Friday. So Again, but that's the most important day. So why didn't you do the notes? Um, why did you take the pictures? Why did you take the pictures? I, because because uh, on again, Saturday after that happened, no, 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 I was no, even I, doubting. Again, 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 again. Exactly. <laughs> this is what I'm saying. Guy got excuses, and I'm only I'm only giving him a hard time because I love this guy. I want him to get better, and uh, I'm tired of yelling at him. So I told him I'm gonna play the reverse game, the opposite game. I go, you're doing really good, dude. You're doing great. And so maybe that'll snap him out of it. I don't know. But uh, I really care about this guy. I want I, him to get better. And he doesn't want to get better. This I, is what, to, I this think is, I learned how to walk. This is the face of somebody who's in denial. Okay, mm. more relaxed. So we're going to work on him here a little bit more because we're going to calm the uh, suboccipital muscles down. So we'll let you guys watch. We did this last week, didn't we? Yeah. It was more painful. It was more painful, right? Yeah. It's less painful right now. Yeah. I remember you jumping. Oh, kind of a non-eventful day yesterday, I feel like, you know, just... Not eventful in a good way or a bad way? In a good way. Pattern is, guys, is that I think he's having more trouble sitting at a table. Uh, how'd you sleep last night, for real quick? Uh, pretty good. 80% better. And so he's, he, he said he's that's the best he slept since he started, so we just got to get him to sit better and have him believe. And so what do you think about this process of how I'm so hard on you? I'm kind of curious because I haven't asked this question yet. It's only still the beginning of the second week. No, I, 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 the other day I was thinking, man, I'm like with the um, David Goggins. I don't know if you know David Goggins mm -hmm. is of chiropractors, but you know, it's like an intense coaching. You yeah. know? As long as, as long as it's not one thing when we're like doing the sessions and then another thing on, on camera, you know what I'm saying? As I'm being honest, right? Consistent. I'm like being honest. Yeah, yeah, as long as we're consistent. We I'm go consistent. Back and forth. I'm yeah. telling you, I'm telling the truth. Yeah. So he's telling he's telling you right now that I don't lie mm -hmm. off camera and do something different on camera. Right. Now we're gonna actually focus on how to have good balance and have good posture at the same time. To have you better balance in the position I teach you. Feet, shoulder width apart here. Progressions. One, two. And just stand here. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Okay. Two minutes. Eyes open, and then 30 seconds, eyes closed. Keep your eyes closed, that left eye. Left eye, keep it closed. Keep the left eye closed. Gotta don't light. grab the door. No, no, I don't want you to do any of this kind of stuff. All right. <laughs> okay, good. Again, the reason I take so much time, guys, is I want him to be totally relaxed so I can get through the joint with the least amount of tension possible. So I'm gonna set up right on the lateral mass of the atlas right here. He feels that, see? As soon as I engage on it, you can see him kind of our whole body tightens up. Feel that, Cleto? Yeah. yeah. It's and so, scary. Yeah, it's scary. Right on the lateral mass. I'm gonna get in position. Mm. And then go right through it. Oh, are you going extra hard or something? Probably. Good. Come towards me again. Okay, dude, what did we learn this morning? This is uh, Wednesday. Only a couple more days left. Um, That my emotions are uh, connected more to your pain. To my pain, yeah. I mean, I kind of always knew that, but... Mm -hmm. It wasn't this dramatic, I think, yeah. with the with the two week program and my body just like not being used to everything. I think it's becoming more apparent. It's an intense program, huh? Yeah, it's intense. And last yeah, night, stupid stress. Yeah, I was I was drove late to go get some food, and then I couldn't find. And 
open store that would have a Snickers bar and I drove to 7-Eleven and 7-Eleven was closed and then the light wouldn't turn His green. Mexican food was getting cold. My, my food was getting he cold. He ran the red light. And so the red so light sweet. wouldn't turn green and I'm just like, you know what? And so he felt great up until this moment and then right. his pain escalated. Yeah, and then the neuropathy just turned on. Yeah, and, and so I was trying to connect the idea of emotion to his pain. But I think these, like what happened on the weekend and what happened last night, like normally, I, I mean, maybe it's an excuse, I don't know, but nor <laughs> normally it wouldn't affect my body as much. As I told him, I go, this program is what we call regression, so you regress through some of the previous episodes of things you had before you came in here, and so his problem is that he's always had these emotional issues, but he suppressed them, and because this program is so intense and so we do so much that it, it amplifies the you know prior um, things that are deep inside us the you know the real cause of our issues and so it's just it's just oozing out of him now and so it's a good thing because it's coming out and we're dealing with it but it's a bad thing because he's freaking out about it a little bit because it doesn't make any sense to him anyways I also found it yesterday so I didn't do this on camera that he had an old injury which we talked about before AC separation when he was in football when he was in high school and um, I started working on him and I really believe that that's part of the issue that's gonna get him better. We got So he really hit it hard yesterday and he did a lot better with the shoulder. I mean, this did better, which made his back better, like that. So we're gonna do it again today. So here, AC separation. You can see, put your shoulder down. You can see this AC separation right here, pretty apparent. And so that creates a lot of tension on his clavicle, which puts pressure all up in here, which he hates. And when I work on his SCM right here, right there, he hates that too, because why? Because this is all getting stretched out. So we're going to do an AC separation adjustment today. We haven't done this yet. Pretty simple, it just shouldn't hurt at all. So I'm going to go here. You can listen, guys. You okay? Yeah. Okay. I was trying to put the AC joint down into the, uh, the uh, clavicle, down into the AC joint. See? There's pain easing right here. This is all because of how bad the clavicle is out of line. So we're gonna just clavicle a second to him. Yeah. This is why he's here, this right here. This whole right side is messed up. Then we're gonna adjust his thoracics and his clavicle. We're gonna adjust all through here and here and his neck. Breathe in and out. Open the mouth. Good. We're gonna do one more little lower here. Breathe in and out. Gotcha. Actually, now I think about it, let's do this one down here, too. Oh. One more, breathe in. You're gonna love this. <laughs> oh. oh. There you go. Sorry. <laughs> On your back. Oh. <clears throat> Face up, please. Huh? Face up. That's just tender right there. Yeah, it is. Can you feel the difference? Yeah. Like how much more we're here versus here? How much percentage wise? I don't know. 100% more, 50% more. Yeah, it's when you get to those These spots, spots right yeah. there and, and up here, right? Yeah. Here. It's all <laughs> in here. Yeah, right here it's like 100% more. Yeah, exactly. So it's crazy, right? Yeah. So uh, this is the end of two weeks here. I'm proud of where he's gotten to. Uh, he has a long ways to go, but I think the last couple days have been a breakthrough for him. Well, I think I'm excited to see where I'm going to be in a couple months gotcha. of applying what I've learned. Sitting, walking, and sleeping, putting them all together. Gotcha. And, um, and just doing that correctly is gonna... The leg neuropathy you came in with, I don't even have a number here what it was at the beginning, but how much better is that? You had it for two years. Yeah, I've had it for two years. Give us a percentage improvement. Maybe like 50%. So I probably think it's a little bit better than that, but I'm not gonna try to convince him. I just wanna know how he feels. Sciatica down the right leg. Yeah, I, I, it's funny because the sciatica, that's how it started, but then it turned into the neuropathy. So... Have you had any sciatica since you've been here the last two weeks? Oh, uh, no. Okay. Okay, neck pain. Neck pain, it was sore the first week. Now How much better overall than when you first came in? You know what? Um, maybe 50%. Gotcha. Okay. Headaches. Um, you didn't really have any headaches in the past, but you had them when you first came in. Yeah. 
Yeah, I haven't had any headaches. No, good, gotcha. Because yeah. the sleep, anxiety, depression, how has that changed? How has your sleep changed? Uh, sleep has gotten a lot better. How about the anxiety and depression? Anxiety, how has your anxiety changed? Because I know it has. Yeah, yeah, I feel more calm now. Like, like I'm remembering that being calm and not having to be like fast all the time or trying to get everything done is better for me and better for my health. So, Any kind of emotional change in you? Do you feel like you're um, more positive? Do you think this is going to go forward do you think you still because he has this really negative eeyore on his shoulder that doesn't think he's going to get better have we broken that a little bit yeah i, I like i said uh, at the beginning i'm excited to see where i'm going to be in two months of, of applying this and you know getting all the pieces together with the other stuff that i've been doing he also got it brought us a uh, um a gift and just so you know the doctor loves gifts i don't care if it's good for you or bad for you so just putting it out there. <laughs> and so. <laughs> Good, beautiful. Good. Right. Because his right shoulder is the issue, and the right clavicle is the issue. I'm going to drop way down, way down. Good, nice. Now we're going to lay on the table face down, please. So I give a little adjustment here to loosen this area up. Good. He loves that one. Boca arriba. Which side's more sensitive? <clears throat> the right. The right side, right? And so not by a little bit, by a lot, right? Right. And so this clavicle, when it's out of whack, puts tension on this muscle right here and all up in here, see? And so I can do this side and it hurts too, but, <laughs> but not as many as this one. <laughs> I gotta show them, I gotta show them. All right, man. <laughs> I was gonna adjust you, adjust you now. Right. <laughs> Ooh. Woo. Look at you, you're not gonna punch me, are you? He almost did. <laughs> no. <laughs> did you guys hear that? That's a clavicle adjustment. Yeah. That's that how you want to go. Just hurts. That just hurts. Okay. Ooh, what? Why did I? Why? Why'd I, you talk? I felt like I was in a wrong position, or I—I I don't know. Yeah. My back. Okay. Oh. <laughs> what happened there? I don't know. You let it go that time, it was good. Did you guys hear the little funk at the end? That is actually the, the noise we're looking for. That little funk is the entire shift of the vertebra.